Welcome back, everybody. So it's time to jump back into Italy and play a little bit more Florence. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, let's pour all of... What on earth? Why did that get so expensive? 31 development? What have you been doing here, man? Seriously, that was so much development. Uh, can I... Okay, before I do that and make it so I can't get the refund. Let's focus it. And... Unstate that. Wow. Didn't expect it to be a... That that much, that much development there. Yeah, I figured you would eventually. Like no matter what I did, even if I pulled him back as being a rival, he was eventually going to rival me. Okay, I'm pushing them back out of Italy. That'll help, so I can start stabilizing again. Okay, I need to ally you. Then I can give you military access, and then I could probably just... No, I can't improve with you any further. Let's see here. Eh, I'm not going to be being nice to Ulm. There we go. Okay, you're a vassal now. Welcome to the party. I want to claim down on him. So the Mamluks did all that fighting and they've gotten nothing out of it. I am fine with that result. Okay, so I can get I cannot get Austria in because he's fighting in another war. That's not a huge war, I don't think. Oh, he's fighting Burgundy. Yeah, that makes sense. So that's gonna be a bigger one for him. I mean it's not really, but it's not just a bunch of small little derps. It's actually somebody bigger. So I can get... Oh. I, I guess we're going after the Ottomans again. Except this time I'm not calling people in because Hungary did it. I'm not actually helping you because I have other things to do. No. I appreciate it though, but no. Yeah, you you keep drifting further away, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and break with you. I don't even really want to go up here, but it's one of those, if I could get free land, why would I ever pass it up? But it's not being very much free land. Like, for some reason, it's just refusing me. Is there anybody that would be close to likely becoming just a free vassal, though? Mulhouse and Bregenz would. And then I could start getting up here if I wanted to. So I could start expanding into, into Germany itself. Oh, fantastic. A terrible ruler. It would be a 235. So I guess 235 is what we're going to go with. Ah. <sighs> Am I, am I still excommunicated? Is that what you're telling me? Fine. I don't know why I have to keep giving you anything. You're just annoying. You hate me. You're always going to hate me. Oh, am I not excommunicated anymore? Did I lose it? Oh, that would be so much more helpful. Don't care if Castile hates me. They're, they're gonna hate me. Hater's gonna hate. Let's go ahead and 
fabricate a claim on North Morocco. No. Just throw it on Lyon. Oh, Karaman, you're disloyal again. Why? I mean, I don't know if Hungary's gonna give me land. That's the thing. I I hope they would, but they probably won't. So it's the, is it worth it for me to go in now and actually help them? I, I really don't think so. Maybe he'll give me land, but I have that nagging suspicion. It doesn't matter what I do. He's not actually going to give me anything. Why is that still Sunni? That shouldn't be Sunni. Oh, fair enough. All right. You do you then. go and then the next thing is global trade I don't think I'm gonna be able to get it to spawn because as usual it's the English channel it has way too much money in it so which is fine it'll go it'll spread fast enough throughout my lands as long as I actually go through and upgrade stuff, it should be fine. Which reminds me. Let's build these trade buildings. Just because, I mean, if I can... The more land I have, the more trade power I have, the more money I can pull out of Castile's pocket, the better off I am. Sure, I'll go with trade power propagation. It does nothing for me right now, but fine. Keep pushing them out of Italy. Papal Separatists. I don't know where you came from, but thank you for showing up. Please leave. Nobody wants you here. I'm pretty sure not even the Pope wants you there, because it'll just make me attack him. So, the Ottomans are beat, which, yeah, of course. I have no idea. I'm just going to wait and see what Hungary does. It's interesting to see what he'll do, but I don't think he's going to do anything favorable. Come on. Is my guy oh there over here because he took that fort I think he actually got extra separatism here which is particularly frustrating walk into him. Alright, Ottomans. I mean, I, if I had more war score, I'd just piece them out and take stuff for me, because then I know I have stuff, but I have no real war score. I have 3%. 
It was more of a joke than anything else. Yeah, I lost a bunch of claims. That sucks. That's fine, though. So, does Morocco still have cores? They do. That might be worth doing as well. To release Morocco and feed him back all of his stuff. Okay, I have an extra Diplo rep. That close? Oh no, not even close. You do not like my economy for some reason. I mean, I don't like my economy either, but it's not like it's that bad. Eh, I'm not going to core it up. It's Italian land, but at the same time, it's the more I core, the more I have to dev down here, uncore later. Just hang back. Just stand at Sayota. His entire army is the size of one of my army groups, so I just have him sit there, not do anything, and just keep him from getting back into my land. Okay, I need to get to Tech 18 for the next idea group. Which means I'm going to have to dev more elsewhere. Wait, Tunis is a vassal? Oh, it's because I'm a lesser partner in the war. Okay. Okay, I can get Dulcadir stuff. I can actually get a decent chunk of Karaman stuff, too. I mean, I'm going to have to be more precise about what I grab for Karaman, but... Because that seems dumb. This is fine. That's fine. I have a Karaman itself. And instead of this one, wherever that is, that... I mean, that's getting there. You know what? Absolutely get on that fort. Why not? Oh, come on, dude. Quit calling me into stupid things. I mean, you gave me nothing. At all. I, I was looking at a betraying you and just leaving the war, but you literally gave me nothing. And you just took this little bit here. That was completely worth it. Oh yeah, definitely. I'm so glad we got involved in that stupid war. Oh, thanks, Hungary. doing why are you doing that no 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 just sail up there don't be dumb
What is it? Uh, Payday 2? Don't act dumb. Don't act dumb. I still have that song stuck in my head, by the way. I know somebody actually found me playing that game that watches this channel. And hi again. Um, for those of you who don't know, there's a game called Payday 2. And I recommend you look it up. It's a very fun game, but it's... Every once in a while, somebody will, like, catch me playing another game that's, like, a multiplayer game. They're like, hey, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, I am. I don't know how you guys recognize my name in other things, but, hey, good for you. Because I use the same tag in a lot of things. I've had this uh, gamer tag since Diablo 2. So, if that gives you a hint on how old this name is, yeah, it's really old. Independence for Greece? Where? Where are they going to get independence for Greece? Rhodes. Okay. That's good to know. There's global trade. Sucks that I don't get it, but fine. Let's... Oh, I'm still at war. Of course I'm at war. Can we peace out, Austria? Please? Pretty please? Pretty, pretty please? So I can't attack you because I'm allied to the Emperor while he's at war and I'm attacking somebody in the Empire or I'm in the Empire. I don't know what exactly it checks for that. Whether you're in the Empire or you're attacking somebody in the Empire, but either way. It's still annoying. There. I've spent it. Portuguese Peru. Okay, can we just be done with this? I'm done with this. I don't care if you're done with this or not. I am done with this. Austria, please break your stupid alliance. You're at war. Ah. Uh... Can I make you break it? No. Alright. Okay, you're finally at peace. I want you to break your alliance with Switzerland. Cool. I shouldn't need any help. In fact, I shouldn't even need two armies. Let's break off one infantry to just stand on this province and siege it down. And let's start improving relations with you, because if I remember right, I have to have high opinion and high trust. And leave one guy there. Go chase him down, please. I didn't. I deleted all the forts because I didn't expect to have to actually chase people around down here. Go get him. Come on. Walk into him. There you go. Smack him. Smack him. Go. Smack him. This is what you get for constantly excommunicating me. And I'm, I, I know, he had no chance, but still, I'm just I'm getting really annoyed at the Pope. And so, as a country that's staying Catholic, that's pretty annoying. Oh, uh, no. You're going to be lucky if I don't integrate you and then hand your land off to Switzerland anyway. Ah, really? Head over there. Okay. 
You're guaranteed by Burgundy. Alright, you just sail out in front of Rome, blockade it, just make it go a little bit faster. Yeah. Rome, will you just take a piece out? You will. Good. That way I don't have to sit here and wait for that. I do have to sit there and wait for uh, Zurich to piece out. Just couldn't remember the name of the province. I'm like, it's, it's Burn? No, no, it burns over here. There we go. I'm vassalizing you, even though you are going to be super annoyed with me. And the HRE doesn't care. Can I become the elector? request it. He says I have 200 opinion with me. So let's see. I mean, sure. Just accelerate it. Oh no. More rebels. The guy there. The guy here. Am I having other rebels? Serbia! Of course I'd be having Serbian rebels. And I have rebels, so I can't do anything. Come on. Thank you. I think I can do this mission now down here, but I don't want to do this yet. Basically, that flips me out of being a republic and into a monarchy, which it's fine. I don't know if I want plutocratic ideas at all. It's good. It's not great, but it's okay. Um, morale of armies, reform progress, and development cost goods produced. It's fine. I just don't know if I necessarily want to devote an entire idea group to it. So I don't know if I want to do that. This... So I'm going to do this? Oh, fine. Okay, so I need a philosopher. You're a natural scientist. What else could I use? I could use a natural scientist. Let's go with you. Influence the church. Now I need to control the church, which, yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's going to be a kind of a difficult situation to put me in there, dude. And then I could do the Academy of Brawn. So. I, I could try and just become the papal controller. He won't. It doesn't matter if he likes me or not, if I can just do that. So. I will dump the points into it, though I have a feeling it still won't go my way. I do appreciate that they give you the option of not being Catholic to get out of this, but I wish there was a better way to do it without having to change religion. Because it's still a... I don't want to. I don't want to have to flip out of the religion. I can... Oh, I can't upgrade you, because you are not... Okay. That's fine. Fine, let's just pour that up finally. Just to help make this go faster. Hey, you're actually pretty good. Too bad it's not going to matter. Since it's under sortition, it doesn't matter at all. Though I guess I could flip out of sortition and all that. Where is it? Down here. Put it to frequent election. 
It's just it's not going to change that much. Oh, I never stated this. Yeah, fair enough. So no inflation, which I'm now gaining inflation. The AI is taking tech really, really, really early. I will point that out. Like, it shouldn't be taking tech this early, but it is. Take Pope points, please. Let's try and avoid another uh, excommunication. The best way I know to do that is to, you know, be the Pope. Okay. Cool! I'm now able to upgrade to a kingdom! Huzzah! So I can do Green's Adranger, which is just points. But points are still points. So, this is still really early. I don't think it's worth it to do it that early. So. Fine. There. I, I don't care if I'm losing out on innovativeness. Uh, I don't need innovativeness that badly. I'd rather not spend that much extra. Okay, I'm about to have to go and fight you. So let's go move you over. Let's move you over. Castile, you have 77,000 troops somewhere. But... Let's stomp you down. It's, I think it's really just here in Kosovo. I think that's all it is. So it's... This is the problem. Well, yeah, that's the only Serbian province I have, huh? So, yeah, let's get that down. I don't know where I'm having any rebels, because I can't see it. Istria. Really? Istria? Here? Oh, yeah, because I can't convert you yet. Yeah, I'll be able to convert you in... 25 years? Dude, why? I can't, like, there's nothing I can do about that. It's just, oh, congratulations, you're going to have rebel problems. I hope you enjoy it. Fine, look to this guy. That should get rid of that. Should get rid of a lot of it. Not all of it, though. Okay, I have five more years until I have to go after you, so. Right now, it's just Castile, and yeah, that's a... Oh, I need to release Morocco. Well, now that you've made me an elector, I don't really care quite so much. So, goodbye. Let's release Morocco. Because then I can cut those cores back. I could also release Lyon, which will get me down to here, I think. Yeah, to here. I don't think that's enough to really justify an entire war over, but it, it's a decent chunk of land. The rest of it is just straight up conquering, so I think I'll, I think I'll do that. Nope, not quite ready yet. Fine. September. I have to wait till September. How about you start moving? Because I think that's still going to be suppressed just enough with that advisor. And where do I have claims on you? Here, let's drop some more claims on you, because that way if I do take other land wherever it happens to be, at least I'm not coring for more than I was before. And then it's just down here, which is so Leon. Alright, I'll release Leon. 
I, it feels weird having to, to record stuff I've had cord for a while, but I don't think that's a big issue. Or as big of an issue. Okay. Castile. Let's have a light chat. You guys come in too. Tafalal, that's a good way to peel off Tunis. Oh, oh! I was not paying attention and that paid the price for that. What is the combat with? 30. Alright. Yeah, I don't have the money yet, do I? How much is it? A thousand ducats to build. Did I lose another? I lost another army. Alright. Hang back. This is why I bring in allies. I can't even compile, I can't even make them, like, merge together to do it. Yeah, that sucks. I didn't think the Portuguese would have their entire army over here, but they did. I mean, it's not going to matter too much. It's just, it's one of those, oh, huh. I didn't expect you to actually do that. <laughs> and yeah, I really didn't. My army tradition is really terrible. I know that. I'm trying to think of a better way to keep it higher. Only thing I can think of is I need to upgrade forts, but I don't think that's necessarily the issue. I think I have plenty of forts, though I probably need, do need to upgrade them. Yeah, I know. I know you're disloyal. I know you want out. I know you want everything. No. Stop being disloyal. Stop being so picky. Stop being so demanding. You will have your freedom when I think it's appropriate for you to have your freedom. Which is going to be never. Get used to being part of my empire. Just not officially yet. I think it's time to get rid of cavalry too. Because I'm already at tech 16. I mean, they're still viable a little bit, but I don't think they're worth the money. So now would be a good time to just get rid of them anyway. Send those cannons up there. Let's sneak this guy up because now I can get them close to each other. And let's make another template of 40. Nope, 40, there we go. All right, Portugal. You look like you're willing to give me a bunch of money. And you are. And since I got those guys stack wiped, you're willing to give me half of it too. Oh, you're not willing to give me that? All right, then we're waiting. Because I will absolutely wait. Oh, you have Moroccan core too. And land here that I think should belong to Morocco. I don't think you should be allowed to have that, no. And Pope, give me your money, give me your war reps. Goodbye. Okay, that's going to take forever. This is going to take a while, but it ain't going to take forever. Again, you're just... Oh, this time it's Switzerland. Okay. Fine. Let's do that. Let's improve relations with you. I have to reconquer your cores, but it looks like I have some easy targets to do so to. Because if I do attack Geneva, Burgundy comes in, but his allies don't. Let's do that. And 
and then compare its view to comply. Comply, that's the word I've been looking for. Comply with that template. And I think I could just take you now. No, I can wait until the end of the year. I won't oh I won't exceed my cap by then. Also not gonna be embracing the tech by then either. Though I could. I don't think it's necessary. I don't need to go into a bunch of debt for no reason. Come on. There we go. Okay, let's get those cannons thrown into the mix. Okay, awesome. Portugal, are you willing to give it to me now? Yeah, you basically are. There we go. Head up towards Burgundy, and then Castile. I want you to hand back all the cores to my vassals that you wrongfully stole from them. You'll do that. Okay. I kind of expected a little bit more, but okay. Finish off that state, and then you're just down to one state. And with that, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you guys are liking what's happening so far, like and subscribe. I will be continuing this game. But, see you guys next time.